and a near £150 million venture. But it means much more than investment. It's hoped it will help retain Cumbria's young talent. Stephanie Lloyd reports. Any new university is about growth, individual growth, new ideas and skills, economic growth. When this generation joins one of the six campuses in Cumbria, they'll certainly be able to branch out. Wildlife illustration, pop music, games design, American studies, criminology and internet marketing. There's a bursting prospectus. The long-term goal is to position itself so that every person in this county has the opportunity of accessing higher education, whether they live in Carlisle, in Barrow, on the west coast or some little village in the middle of the Lake District. Founded through an amalgamation of St. Martin's College and Cumbria Institute of the Arts, it's already the biggest provider of teacher training in the country. The Eric Martlew, for example, and his colleagues have been campaigning for this for a very long time because it's one of those things which means that people can build on that greater educational achievement. So you know, today's a great day for the whole of the community, for people, the staff here, for people in the local community groups and the local council who've been fighting to make sure that Cumbria can have a university. It's hoped the new university will reverse the brain drain of young talent from the county. Thank you very much. Now, it's a terrifying prospect, but what would you do? A woman who